I should have intro like that. <laughs> this weekend I came to camp at Grand Beach. You can see a lot of people. Yesterday, but could not record anything for you guys because it was late. We came around at 10 o'clock. So today, I hope Sky doesn't cry. <laughs> Hello, dragon. How did I do last time better than this? Okay. No, I think I was holding it like this. Okay. Yeah. Let's try again. Every video should have intro like that. <laughs> <laughs> I'll have to tell you guys about this. This is the best purchase I have made in the last five years maybe. It is a lifesaver. See how it works. Screen. I'll show you. See, if you go for camping this time of the year when you have so much mosquitoes, you have to have one of these. These are like magic. Right now, I'm gonna show you guys some cams straight some cams and uh, how it looks that's the garbage place where you'll throw your garbage as you can see that there are good distance between campsites There is a washroom, you'll have multiple washroom in the same bay and they're very nice actually. One tip though. Oh, that's your loud camper with the generator. Yeah. <laughs> Those are some kits. Now, one thing though, you'll have to remember. When you're camping and you have to, you know, go to the washroom, Go before you really need to because you have to wait on the line. Especially right now with COVID-19, you cannot have more than one person in the washroom. This place is full. Oh, no idea. It might be a hiking trail. We should check it out later. Let's get out of the bay now and find the hiking place. I like the tent. Small. I came to this campground twice before and both times it rained. I hope it doesn't rain this time, you know? It will be horrible if it does. This is the parking lot you'll find when you come here in front of the office and that is the firewood place. 
you'll find fireworks there in the evening but if you really need some you can go to the nearby gas store here it's like five minutes driving that is the office right there i'm gonna go to the office and ask if i can get some information about hiking hello there I'm, I'm here looking for some information on the uh, hiking trail. Trail is wrapped up here. You're currently here. Okay. Perfect. This is information for the trail itself. Okay. Thank you so much. You're welcome. This hiking trail is uh, 2.1 kilometer. Takes about an hour. We'll try to keep it short because we're waiting for a friend. What time is it, Dad? 235. We got an hour and Okay, we good. Alright, let's take a hike on this trail. Look at that, my favorite rock. We can see lots of rocks here. There. See the interesting part about these rocks is you see this rounded and smooth is because they traveled for a long time throughout the water and river that's how they get smoothened and then if you find a rock that is not smooth that means they got broken down or they didn't travel as much like this one's broken they broke it after these red things mostly garnet now interesting part about these rocks is sometime during the lifetime of these rocks they used to be in the mantle so they used to be lava in the mantle which is core of our planet and they came up throughout the volcano and other geological activities and sometime in future they will actually go back where it came from I have a very bad joke right now but I don't want to say it so you can see this is sandy that's that's the reason they call it ancient beach trail because in ancient time it used to be a beach but right now you can see forest we're back in the parking lot now it was a nice hike on this ancient beach trail so if you were looking for something that is short like an hour hike you could do this you could also actually uh, bring your bicycle here i saw many people with bicycles we ended up coming to a different parking lot so we don't have our car here now we're gonna go find it <laughs> i think it'll be somewhere close but it's strange <laughs> somebody took it away from us <laughs> so that's west beach east beach Holy me, like, do you remember? If you go there, you have to go long way. Oh. I think we just walked whole other side of the trail. We have to walk back maybe at least, what, two kilometers? We're on the highway right now. Nice. Very good. Good walk, guys. <laughs> Need a lift. Time to burn all yeah, see, this is a good learning point for you guys. Whenever you go to walk on a trail, take a map and read it. Don't just walk around with it. That's not how it works. We are back to the campground again. Now we're gonna walk a little more and then hopefully you'll find the parking lot we have used to park our car. Where is it? Right there. Oh my god, it feels good to sit after walking for an hour and a half at least. That's how our parents used to go to school, you know. Every morning our parents used to wake up and like, you know, we have to take a hike through like 10 kilometer trail. We have like bushes where we have tigers and crocodiles gonna eat us. And then after fighting all these animals and bad weather, yeah. Walking 10 kilometers, our parents used to go to school. And same shit on their way back to it. Just imagine how tough their life was. <laughs> Story of brown parents.
Okay, this is camping in Grand Beach for me. Every time I come here to camp, I will be rained on. It is raining right now. We came in the car to get the shelter. This is my third time camping here and it's always rains when I come to camp. So don't come to camping with me in Grand Beach. There will be a rain for sure. One point one kilometer, not big. You know, 